I think um, I think to be honest, uh, most of the times that we have played them in these conditions, they've been really good opposition, and so I think the last game is just a highlight of how how strong they can be in these conditions. And um, for them to take it that close against a team like India, uh, I don't think anyone can take them lightly, you know. And we have to start again, adapt to the conditions, and um, try to cater for the players that are playing that we're playing against because um, you know they're fantastic players over here. I think um, we just got to keep things pretty, you know, relatively similar to what we have been doing, because um, the opposition is completely different to the ones that we faced beforehand. But I think we still got to treat it like any other game, and play the same way that we have been playing. You know, adapt to conditions, adapt to the players that we're playing against, and um, try to combat um, what we can for the ground and the things that we were put in front of. I haven't had a look at this wicket, but I saw the wicket against. Um, India, I think, I think India and Pakistan turned quite a bit, but um, again, it looks pretty different because it hasn't been under covers for as long. So, you know, no idea what to expect, but um, we'll figure that out um, once once we get get the ball rolling. Ah, uh, yeah. To be completely honest, I didn't expect it to turn as much as it has. Um, the most of the tournaments that I've watched over here in the past, um, you know, few years have been pretty pretty decent batting surfaces, and um, for them to turn this much was unexpected, but. Uh, we've had to adapt and I think we've done that pretty well so far. Uh, yeah, I think uh, from your first part, I think um, Kane as a captain has been really good over here. You know, he's a really, really good captain when it comes to teaching you to adapt to different conditions because he does that with his own, uh, own batting skill as well. So it's been really good to have him over here in, in this tournament so far and um, long may it continue. You know, I think he'll be really good for New Zealand cricket in the future and um, 